PreSonus Era Studio Monitors speak for themselves. The only true studio monitor for multimedia, gaming, watching movies, or producing your next hit. Now comes included with Studio One Prime and Studio Magic plug-in suite, over $1,000 US dollars worth of music production software. 3.5-inch woven composite drivers produce a more powerful bass response with a more accurate overall sound. 1-inch ultra-low-mass silk dome tweeters eliminate harshness and provide balanced high-frequency sound. The only monitors in their class with acoustic tuning. This enables you to get pristine sound quality in any room. Crossover frequency, 2.8 kHz. Stereo aux input for your smartphone, headphone jack for private listening, volume, and power on slash off are located on the front panel for your convenience. 50 watt class AB amplification, 25 watts per speaker, provides plenty of volume and headroom for near field monitoring. Studio quality industrial design. They look as great as they sound. Protection, RF interference, output current limiting, over temperature, turn on slash off transient, on slash off transient. Introducing the Edifier R1280DB Powered Bookshelf Speakers. The R1280DB's Bluetooth functionality makes streaming from an electronic device in ease. Multiple input options are included to guarantee lossless connectivity. A wireless remote and built-in treble and bass adjustment make it easy to tune the unit. These speakers deliver powerful audio in an elegant package. M-Audio BX3 to 1 Desktop computer speakers with studio monitor sound, 120 watt powered speakers deliver studio speaker sound, perfect for gaming, podcasting, streaming, DJ performances and more. Premium components, stereo speakers with an acoustically inert MDF cabinet and bass reflex design for deep, rich sound, 3.5 Kevlar low frequency drivers and one natural silk dome tweeters. An immersive listening experience, computer-optimized tweeter waveguide for precise imaging, high and low EQ for dialing in the perfect sound, rear ports for extended bass response. Versatile, whether you're looking for gaming speakers, DJ speakers, PC speakers, record player speakers or studio speakers, the BX3's 1 quarter, 1 eighth and the RCA inputs offer complete hookup flexibility. Everything you need, includes one passive speaker, one active speaker, one eighth speaker cable, one eighth to one eighth cable, one eighth to RCA cable, Pro Tools, First M Audio JBL Studio Monitors, two JBL 306P MK2 powered six inch two way studio monitors. High quality, JBL 306P MK2 has been equipped with acclaimed three series transducers that now perform even better. Here deep, accurate, and tightly controlled bass, thanks to a long throw 6.5 inch woofer and the patented JBL Slipstream low frequency port. Dynamic range, with 112 watts of total power, the dual, integrated Class D power amplifiers, custom designed by JBL for each transducer, give you a generous dynamic range for any project. Powerful drivers, from music production and podcasting to cinematic sound design or daily vlogging, enjoy the output and power you need to hear exceptional detail at any volume, even at peak SPL. Simply plug in, power on, and start creating. And start creating. Introducing the Edifier R1700 BT Bluetooth Bookshelf Speakers. The R1700 is designed with a classic walnut finish and a 10 degree upward angle to better direct sound for desktop users. These speakers deliver the cleanest audio with its built-in processors, Bluetooth connectivity, wireless remote, and onboard bass and treble dials add convenience to these well-rounded speakers. Alesis Elevate Studio Alesis Elevate 5 Studio Speakers enable you to listen to mixes, masters and multimedia content with impressive clarity and warm, full sound. Elevate 5 Speakers bring out every detail of your sound, unencumbered and crystal clear. Their custom wooden cabinets have a dense construction that provides natural bass. Elevate 5 Studio Speakers contain powerful, 5-inch woofers, crisp, 1-inch silk dome tweeters and dedicated power. Features 
perfect for home studios, video editing, gaming and mobile devices. Separate high and low frequency drivers with crossover. 5-inch low frequency driver and ported enclosure delivers rich, tight bass. 1-inch silk dome tweeter provides smooth, clear highs. 40 watts per channel output power, 80 watts total. High density wood cabinet suppress unwanted resonances. Elliptical tweeter waveguide optimizes dispersion and stereo imaging. Carefully formed baffle radiuses reduce edge diffraction. Edge diffraction. KRKRP5 on KRK's Rocket Generation 4 utilizes matching drivers made with Kevlar to ensure the same sonic integrity across all frequencies and minimizes listening fatigue. DSP-driven room tuning with 25 visual graphic EQ settings helps minimize and correct problems in your acoustic environment. Works with the KRK app to set up your room for better monitoring and faster mixing. The custom-designed efficient Class D power amplifier drives the speakers evenly at reduced operating temperatures and improves audio integrity. The built-in brick wall limiter automatically engages at maximum amp level to maintain a balanced sound, protect the system, and offer better and wider dynamics. It features a low resonance enclosure for minimal distortion and colorization. A high-density ISO foam pad decouples the speaker from the surface to minimize vibration transmission for improved clarity. Active Room Tuning one of the best features of the Rocket G4 line of studio monitors is the option for DSP-driven active room tuning. A first in its class, the Rocket G4 line offers an LCD graphic display for visualizing equalization settings, and Rocket G4 monitors come standard with 25 different onboard EQ settings to help minimize and correct problems in many acoustic environments. The Rocket G4 line takes acoustic control one step further when you connect your monitor to the KRK app, available for both iOS and Android. With the app, you can accurately calibrate EQ settings to assist with proper speaker placement and level matching through use of the real-time room acoustic analyzer. In just a few simple steps, you can determine the best settings for your monitor and really get the most out of your audio. Most out of your audio. Behringer Studio Monitor, eating music or simply enjoying it, you want a serious speaker with accurate sound. The Studio 50 USB's ultra-linear, 100-watt digital monitor speakers combine exceptional USB and analog connectivity in a bi-amp, two-way speaker configuration, providing the perfect sonic upgrade for any audio or video application. And when it comes time to let your creative juices flow, Studio 50 USB has the recording studio-grade sound that gives you the power to dial in your perfect sound. Every detail of your mix comes through in all its pristine clarity, with the kind of dynamics and impact that only a high-resolution studio monitor system can deliver. By amplification, the path to absolute signal integrity with its 100 ultra-clean watts of digital output, delivered through separately powered drivers via a true bi-amping mode with two amplifiers per speaker, the Studio 50 USB delivers high-resolution sound that really brings out the best in your music. You will notice that most competitors apply simple passive crossovers, which not only inaccurately separate the frequency spectrum, but most importantly impact the driver's performance. Behringer has gone the extra mile, driving each woofer and tweeter with a separate amplifier for absolute signal integrity. Great care was taken to match the system's amplifiers and crossover points specifically to the woofer and tweeter for optimal efficiency. Studio 50 USB's performance provides ultra-linear frequency respo. Near frequency respo. Hey guys, Perry from Rockville here, and today I'm gonna to teach you how to set up your APM speakers. These are the perfect speakers to use for any studio setup, computer setup, and much more. Now these speakers come in three different colors, the painted black, which I have right here, the painted white, and the classic wood vinyl finish. Now the APM series comes in five inch, 6.5 inch and 8 inch versions, but the setup for each of these speakers are exactly the same. So along with the speakers themselves, you'll get a speaker cable to connect the two speakers and a power cable to power them up. So the first thing we can do when setting up the speakers is take the included power cable, take the female end and plug it into the power socket on the back of the speaker. Then we'll take the other 
end and plug that into a power outlet. Then we'll take one end of our included speaker cable and plug that into the back where it says out to left speaker. Now it's very important to line up this groove part here with the bottom pin of the output so that the speaker cable will fit in correctly. So once you have it plugged in, you'll want to tighten up this thread piece here to lock the speaker cable in place. Then we'll take the other end and plug that into our left speaker. Again, you'll want to be sure to line up this groove with the bottom pin of this insert as well. Then again, we'll want to tighten up the threaded part to lock it in place. Now the cool thing about these speakers is that there are many different ways to input into them. For example, we have the RCA inputs that we can use to connect anything with an RCA output. So for example, I can take my RCA to aux cable, plug these ends into the RCA input, then take my other end and plug that into any media device with a headphone jack like this tablet here. So now I'm gonna go ahead and turn on my speakers. Now to hear the speakers, we'll wanna be sure to raise the volume knob on top here. So let's hear how they sound. Nice body, nice low end to them. Crisp high end as well. Now another really cool feature on these speakers is the bass and treble switches that we can use to really dial in our sound. We can either take away 4 dB of bass or treble if we switch it to the left. We can keep them right at the center if we switch it to the middle. And then we can even add 4 dB of bass and treble if we switch it to the right. We can even connect our headphones to the speaker by using this input right here. We can also use this USB input here to connect the speakers to any computer. We can even use these XLR and quarter inch TRS input jacks to connect any interface or mixer. Let me grab an interface and my computer to show you that setup now. All right, so here I have my audio interface connected to my computer. Now to connect my interface to my speakers, I'm going to need two TRS quarter inch cables. Now before we make any connections, let's make sure that the volume knob on our speaker is turned all the way down to avoid any unwanted noise. We'll just take one end of our cables and plug them into the left and right outputs on our interface. Then we'll take the other ends and plug them into the quarter inch inputs on our speaker. So now we can go ahead and raise the volume on our speaker. Then we'll wanna make sure that the main volume on our interface is turned up as well. Now a very important note, if you're using your speakers with your computer and interface, you'll just wanna go into the sound settings of your computer and select the output device to your interface. Otherwise you won't be hearing anything coming out of these speakers. So let's test out this setup now. Yeah, there we go. Now this is a perfect setup if you wanna use your speakers with your interface and your computer with a DAW like GarageBand, Audacity, or Pro Tools. So I hope this showed you guys how easy it is to set up your APM speaker series. But of course, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to reach out to our customer support team through phone or email. As always guys, I'm Perry from Rockville and I'll see you next time.